welcome back to part seven, where we move slightly to the left. <laughs> <laughs> it's a whole new world we live in. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. We didn't even have time for the Orange Islands theme song. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Just went straight to Johto. <laughs> that was the easiest game of Simon I've ever fucking seen. Left, 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 right, up, left. Yeah, they they can go from. What was up with Dixie's arms there? She was like Kermit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, you have no idea. Water level. I love the ambience music for this. Yeah, the music is nice. I still hate water levels. Good yeah. God, there's a lot of coral reef, coral reef in this ocean. <laughs> Why is there coral reef in the in, in Canada? Canada. I don't know. Ask Clement. Canada, is there <laughs> is there coral reef in your lakes? You're asking Canada itself. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, we're, we're Canada's not even... sentient. Well, actually, it isn't. That's Australia. Clement. Are we even are we even in the ocean right now? Or in a no, lake? We're in, we're in a lake uh, under a waterfall. Coral reef in a lake under a wa what the? Only in yep. Canada. Only in Canada. <laughs> Only in Canada. Blame Canada. Blame <laughs> Canada. Canada. <laughs> I will say that this looks uh, visually more impressive than the DKC one underwater levels. Yeah, um, <laughs> it makes at the no same, goddamn at the same time. <laughs> it kind of reminds me of the Dan level in TMNT. If you guys ever played that, uh, God, I'd rather not be reminded of that. Shatters yeah. my ass and splinters my balls. <laughs> no, Should no, I be glad that I've never played that HGN game? Because I used to play that game all the time too, back in the early '90s, and mm -hmm. I wish to forget those times. But uh, every time I see Coral Reef, I can't help but think about that. Hmm. I'm I'm turning to the music. <laughs> when it comes to the idiot. design, though, this doesn't look like a badly designed water area. It's a water level. <laughs> it's a water level. I always thought the country games had better water controls than Mario underwater levels. Yeah. Well, that's because when you're um, here, I think uh, when you're in a Mario uh, in Mario. Uh, when you press, uh, when you press the A button to go up, you go up very, uh, jump, jolty. I think it's a little bit smoother in Donkey Kong, if I remember correctly. Yeah. You, yeah, I would imagine. Uh, unless you're, uh, I don't remember if DKC had the, uh, if you hold up while you're swimming up, you'll go faster. I, I would yeah, like to, I, uh, I, I would like know. to, I would like to pick, uh, the animation for this guy, <laughs> the, the swordfish, okay? Clearly, when you... <laughs> when a swordfish like this swims, what it's supposed to be doing is uh, moving its fin from left to right. Yeah, no, he's, he's spamming the attack button. Which yeah, I'm, spam I'm, I'm definitely spamming the attack button to when move faster. When you're spamming the attack button, though, what it you looks like is... God. <laughs> it looks like you're caterpillaring through the water. <laughs> I, I am, you're doing it wrong on <laughs> Oh, everyone... oh! You have to skip the you have to skip the the Black. goal to get the DK to get point. it. Every wa every water level like that, you end up you have to pull the flag, so you end up having to go through a cave, and the DK coin is always there. Oh, I love this music. Oh, oh, wait! So Donkey Kong Country Returns didn't invent the rocket barrel. It's, I, no. I, I can blame this game for all that frustration. <laughs> actually, actually, the rocket, actually, the, the rockets rocket here are automatic. Yes, the rockets here just go up and down. Um, you'll hate the the last the last level before the boss. Yeah. There's no way I'll hate the games here this here more than Donkey Kong Country Returns. You know, the only difference between this level to my eyes and a Klonoa stage is that the waterfall is actually flowing downward. <laughs> Wait, were the waterfalls going up in Kelowna? I don't remember. Yeah, I remember. <laughs> I've tried. <laughs> he just said he doesn't remember. <laughs> <laughs> let me let me convince you again. <laughs> yes, they were flowing upwards, and then they arced around and flew be flowed back up the river instead of going straight up into the sky. <laughs> oh. I do like how this level makes you go like behind and in front of the waterfalls. That's all I have to say on that. Do you want to know what makes no sense? Games where waterfalls are treated as a block of water so you can swim up the waterfall? Never well, got it, how that's supposed to work. With enough force, you can. <laughs> yeah, but nobody's ever going to have that much force. 
Yeah, How do you think Sam is doing? But Ryan, if being, having, doing. having enough force to swim up a waterfall is like having enough force to swim up air. It's it's harder than swimming through gravity. <laughs> it's a video uh, game. It's quite a lot. You know, having enough force to swim up air might li might be possible before swimming up a waterfall. It's called flying. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is called flying. On the other hand, swimming up a waterfall, the water is quite a lot heavier than air, and it's acting against you. <laughs> and most useless animal buddy again. He did give me the nice visual image of uh, Dixie or a uh, kitty, uh, you know, swimming up the waterfall like fucking salmon. <laughs> 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 they got their they got their arms tied together and they're just salmon flopping their bodies <laughs> up salmon and Salmon don't swim up waterfalls; they jump over them. Okay, they well that's even more visually humorous. I uh, I love how when Dixie jumps on that big blue gator, he's like, "Come at me, bro." <laughs> Are those this game's version of crushes? Yeah. Yes. And only, only uh, blah, blah blah blah. Kitty can kill him by jumping on him. I do like the look of this uh, stage theme, though. I do like how the, the mountains are richly colored. Makes the greens kind of reminds me of Red Mountain, actually, from Sonic Adventure. <laughs> so that's why you like it. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Don't you mean Red Mountain reminds you of this game, John? I don't no. know. I, I played Sonic it, Adventure before I played this. It doesn't matter which one came out first. It depends on which one you played first. Yes. <laughs> Although, <laughs> you're only going to be reminded of Red Mountain if you played the Dreamcast version first, because the GameCube version got rid of all the grass. <laughs> well, why would there be grass? It's a mountain. This is a mountain grass too. This is more of a cliff than a mountain. Grass grows it's on it. mountains. Grass so, yeah. does grow. You know, I've gone hiking in mountains. I was with the Boy Scouts. There was plenty of grass. You're a Boy Scout. Trees. I, I was a Boy Scout. Not a very prolific one. I never got past <laughs> second class. But um, the uh. Yeah, there was plenty of grass. There were plenty of trees. There was plenty of green. It was very nice. In this fact, is the same. Uh, this is the same like... level theme from DKC two. No, no, no. It looks pretty similar. It's from earlier in the game. Yeah, it's from earlier in the game. We're just shimmering, shimmying along stationary ropes. We're zipping along really fast. <laughs> <laughs> they're, they're monkeys. <laughs> yeah, but it, you know. It, 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 uh, what's her name? Dixie Kong isn't really moving her hands that fast. <laughs> it's like she's not to propel. It's a video. Greasy ropes. It's ropes. Greasy ropes. It's a video game. <laughs> well, you know, for a game that, that banks on being graphically impressive for its time, I kind of expect better animations. I'm sorry. The animation's pretty fluid. Like, it's well I just, I just play this game really fast. It's really <laughs> fluid, but it makes no sense. Sense. It's a video game, Lewis. What do you guys think, yeah. like, in terms of graphics? Would you, would you say this is about as graphically impressive in 96 as DKC was graphically impressive in 94? Um, I would say so. Yeah. I don't know, I have... I, I don't think it's really all that much better than DKC 1. Uh, oh, hey, there's one... One thing about Donkey Kong is that it, it looks nice, but the three games look pretty similar, except for different stage themes and maybe a little bit difference in brightness here and there. And ju just to go off on a random topic, Jesus Barrel has a brother, Kamikaze Barrel. <laughs> John the Baptist Barrel? I thought it was, uh, <laughs> was, was going to say that. <laughs> no, wait, if, wait, if this is a Kamikaze Barrel, then that would be Judas Barrel, actually. <laughs> wait. Like, seriously, th this barrel's whole point is to hold onto ropes and try and run into you. Wait, wait, yes, when, did, a, when, when did Judas perform a death charge? <laughs> <laughs> with a smile on his face, too. Uh, it's the Bible, the Lost Levels. <laughs> Bible 2, Bible Harder. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> they, they, don't, they don't like to talk about that, though. 